Hi, this is Brad Linder with Little Buting, and this is not a USB flash drive, even though it says 32 gigabytes and looks like a USB flash drive. You plug one end into a computer, and the other end, it's uh, sort of a pass-through, and you can plug the other end into your phone. So you take a USB cable from your phone, plug it into your computer, use this as a pass-through, and what that does is it connects your phone to your PC in an interesting way that lets you uh, extend your phone onto the PC, so you can sort of use it as a remote control and a remote viewer, and you can see your notifications from your phone and so forth. You can also extend your desktop onto your phone so you can drag your mouse uh, cursor off the edge of your screen, you can copy and paste text between it. So why don't you show me a little bit about how this works. So thanks Brad. So I'm going to show you first the extend mode uh, because we talked, talked about that a while ago. So how you do that is let me close the, the picture in picture and just activate that. Very simple. I just go to settings and I just tell the system that it's on my left hand side. Um, and I just apply a setting and now it's activated. So now I'm just, all I have to do if I want to control my phone is I'm just going to drag my cursor to the left hand side, just like any extend display. And now my, my cursor is now activated on my phone. And obviously I can like click it on things. I could use my keyboard to type, uh, do shortcuts that you would have for Android. It's very convenient. And it's especially convenient if you have a bigger screen, right? But for a smaller screen, as you've seen a while ago, it's much more convenient if you would just put the, your phone directly on your PC. Now, obviously, you can think of like a lot of things you can do with this. So I have some applications right here that you could probably uh, use Link for, for games and productivity. But I'm going to show you some features that can only be done through Link. Um, think about messaging, right? So one thing is like controlling it and typing it. But another thing you could do is that you can copy information from your PC. So imagine this is a website or an email. Copy it direct directly and paste it to your phone. So just imagine if I have a big list, very, very simple. That's number one. Uh, second thing you do, obviously since you already have your um, your phone right beside you, right in front of you, um, if you're gonna copy files, all they have to do is drag the file. I could highlight more if I wanted to. Drag it, drop it, good to go, it's on my phone. And to do to do something like in reverse, like to, from the phone to the PC, we built a very, very simple application that sorts all of your documents to image, videos, audio, and others. And obviously, the thing that you have to do is just select them, hit transfer, and good to go, right? Now, the last thing that, that you can do with this, and this is for fun, actually, um, if you have any video or media installed into your phone, you could potentially um, cast that to your PC and now it's playing on the full HD resolution with a bigger screen. Not only that, but the audio as well is passed through. So imagine if I have a speaker plugged in, now you're enjoying better sound as well. So again, that's the Novo Link. Uh, I think you mentioned it's $39 and will be available March of this year. And uh, does it requires a USB 3.0 port? No, no. Um, the link itself is USB 3.0. That's because internally it has this flash drive, so you're enjoying faster speeds. Can but you use it on a laptop that has USB 2.0? Exactly. So USB 3.0 is backwards compatible. So okay. yes, USB 2.0. And can speed. you still do video and everything? Everything. Okay. And uh, doesn't need a Lenovo laptop. Doesn't need a Lenovo phone. Just needs the $39 Correct. link Correct. and an application from Google Play Store. Correct. And it has the drivers for your computer. So if you install it, it plug it into a computer running Correct. Windows 7 or later and it should install the software that you need in order to use Link. Absolutely. So that's a quick look at Lenovo's Link, which uh, works with Android 5.0 and later, Windows 7 and later, and also happens to have 32 gigs of storage, so looks like a USB flash drive and you can use it like one, <laughs> but there are cheaper flash drives if that's all you want. That's true, that's true. This is Brad Linder with Lilliputing.